Hello everybody, welcome to the Mike from LA1 Network here on YouTube and welcome to my Monday Night Raw review for November 4, 2013. Got it via WWE app here, so let's take a look here. The first one is Who Could Stop the Wyatts? Both CM Punk and Daniel Bryan suffered brutal attacks in the hands of the Wyatt family last week. They are reeling from the assaults. Will either of them be in any condition to seek retribution this week? After the Luke Rowan and Eric Harper, Eric Rowan and Luke Harper, excuse me, defeated the primetime players on SmackDown, the creepy trio looks more unstoppable than ever. Second, what must the Authority do to maintain its empire? The Authority got what they wanted when Randy Orton claimed the WWE title thanks to Shawn Michaels and Hell in a Cell. But Big Show promptly put an end to the party at last, the next night on Raw, thus getting banned for life. A li is a lifetime ban enough to keep the world's largest athlete from showing up on this week's Raw? Next, the Authority's newest weapon. Last week, Kane removed his mask to pledge allegiance to Stephanie. With the shield already at the Authority's disposal, adding the big red monster may earn some amount of might to task what they could all have to do. What? And also, I guess they're trying to promote See No Evil 2. Good call there. Next, can Goldust and Cody eclipse the shield's reign? It, it's not busy doing the authority's bidding. The shield chucked up one of the top five tag team title reigns of all time. Since winning their jobs back, the tag team, the Rhodes brothers, have competed in a newfound Viger. Which team will be the challenge to the Rose Brothers for their titles? Have to be the real Americans because they got the win over them. Weed the people. Who will see the face next? The champ is here and he fired up. After defending his world title against Damian Sandow, who is the first person to lose legitimately. Don't forget Cena won by disqualification. And they took down Sandow and the real Americans on SmackDown. With his sooner than expected return, sooner proved without a shadow of a doubt he lives for a challenge. Who will be the next guy? I'm thinking it has to be Alberto Del Rio. That's Miley, my, what I'm thinking. And, uh, excuse me. And I think that should just about do it. Let's see here. Oh, by the way, let's do the over the raw results from last week. John Cena and Dressed the Universe say he returned to the round top of the champs back. Next, Damian Sandow cast in, obviously. Next it was Biggie Langston defeating Dean Ambrose last on Hell of a Cell. He lost by he won but Biggie Langston won by count out here. Biggie Langston won by disqualification. The Shield did beat defeated Biggie Langston and the Usos. Shawn Michaels apologized. Got yes locked. Lost Matadonis defeated three MB. Ole AJ Lee and Tamina defeated the Bella Twins. Kane beat the Miz in a very short contest. CM Punk defeated Ryback in a street fight in an app boat. The Real Americans defeated the tag team champions. Alberto Dorio addressed John Cena. Natalia beat a Summer Rae. Big Show crashed coordination championship celebration and that's it. And that's it, guys. Thank you guys for watching my Raw preview. And stay tuned tonight for my first Raw review in two weeks.